And every day here at 7 Eyewitness News, we are dedicating a reporter towards answering your questions that you sent to us on social media. This morning, 7 Eyewitness News reporter Nikki Dementry delivering some answers about the DMV, flying, and more. Hi, Nikki. At 7 Eyewitness News, we're answering your pressing questions as we work from home with the help of some experts. We start with some questions about the DMV. Obviously, these are unprecedented times. Uh, these aren't ordinary times. That's Erie County Clerk Mickey Kearns. He answered DMV related questions like this one from Nancy in Buffalo. She asked, my car is due by the end of the month. Will the DMV penalize people if it's not done? The governor has deemed car shops uh, essential services. And uh, my recommendation is if you can go, you can. As of today, uh, we have not received any executive order uh, from the governor uh, for that specific issue, but we have reached out uh, to the state DMV. To Niagara County with this question from Chris, is the DMV extending the expiration date for driver's license since they are closed? Well, the simple answer is yes, at least through April 19th, provided DMVs open again. New York Governor Andrew Cuomo put through an executive order allowing any driver's license, non-driver identification, or registration set to expire on or after March 1st, now to be extended for the time being. That's true for DMVs across the state, regardless of the county. Moving to air travel, Victoria from Buffalo asked, how contagious is coronavirus on an airplane? Would everyone on the flight be infected if there was an infected person on board? Usually if someone is infected on an airplane, the risk is fairly limited to sort of the row that that individual is in and to a lesser degree the row in front of them and behind them. Moving on to this question from Jessica, how long will it be for it to go away coronavirus? I think that's a million dollar question right now, right? Yeah, we, we don't know at this point. I think the way we need to look at this at this point, given that uncertainty, is we just really need to take it day by day. All right, so like Dr. Russo says, let's take this day by day. Keep sending us your questions. We're going to the experts to get them answered. Just log on to WKBW.com backslash coronavirus questions to send them in. But for now, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay strong, Buffalo. Nikki Dementry, 7 Eyewitness News. All right, Nikki, thank you. Now, if you have any questions that you want to answer, just write to us on any of our social media pages or head to wkbw.com slash coronavirus questions.